Hi everyone, welcome to Liberty Park Music. My name is West and I'll be your instructor for this lesson. Today we're going to look at a piece called Staccato, which was composed by the esteemed 19th century pianist, composer, and educator Karl Reinach. Now, as the name suggests, um, this piece is primarily going to focus on the execution of staccato articulations. However, um, as you'll see, one of the things we're also going to be looking at is the contrast between articulations, um, legato and staccato both. And this piece also has some interesting rhythmic features that are probably a little bit different than what you've commonly been seeing um, in your other pieces of this nature. Um, so, let's check it out. Okay, so there are two main points for you to consider that will really make a difference in how you're able to bring this piece to life. First, articulation. Now, you can see if you look at this that the staccatos are only part of the story here. We actually have slurs between the third and first beats of the measures that serve as important points of contrast to highlight those staccatos. And if we ignore them, this piece ends up sounding significantly more static and flat. So let me play through the first five measures to give you an example. Um, if I play these with the slurs, uh, you can hear that the staccatos are kind of led into, which really helps to emphasize their bounce. Um, it also makes the technique we're using to make them happen easier, but more on that in a moment. Now, if I play the whole thing staccato, You can hear that now everything feels just a little too stark. Um, there's not as much textural draw. Um, and the danger here is probably not that you might want to play everything staccato, because obviously not everything is marked staccato, um, but it, that, that it can be easy to neglect the musical pronunciation of these slurs, which really makes a difference in the sound and therefore in the overall feel of the piece. Now, Talking about the staccatos themselves, if you're not already familiar with the technique uh, you want to use to achieve them, what you're going for is halfway between a quick finger strike and a wrist bounce. Um, you're pushing forward into the keys with your fingers and at the same time letting your wrist elevate um, as you hit the bottom of the keys, which can basically be thought of as uh, bouncing off the bottom of the keys. I actually like to think of it not as a finger push, um, but as a wrist pull, almost as though I'm bouncing my wrist first, and then the action of bouncing my wrist is naturally pushing my fingers down into the keys, um, which you can kind of see the natural response of this when I do it sideways like this. It's almost like if you've ever seen a, um, an ocean creature like a jellyfish or a squid move, the tentacles stay in place as the body moves and then um, trail along afterwards. Anyway, that's how I like to think of it. But for the most um, part, for most people, the image of bouncing um, is usually enough to get it down. Kind of like that. And as I mentioned before, the slurs, playing the first note of these figures legato into that staccato actually really helps. Uh, somehow it feels like you're doing less work to get down to the bottom of the keys when you're not having to come at it from another staccato. So another point on which uh, making sure those legatos are happening is really key. You can see when I do that that my hand is already dropped down um, by the time it gets to that next key. Thanks for watching this lesson from Liberty Park Music. If you enjoyed this lesson and learned something from it, do us a favor, hit that like button. And if you really liked it, share it around. Let your friends and family check it out too. If you want to find more lessons like this or explore other piano-related topics, please come visit us at libertyparkmusic.com.
We have full piano courses ranging from beginner to more advanced levels, and everything is online and streaming 24-7 so that you can design your music learning around your schedule and learn in the comfort of your own home from a talented roster of professional teachers and musicians. Come check us out.